back to this channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how I do my everyday makeup. So let's get started. So the first thing that I do before applying my makeup is moisturize my face and I use the Ultra Light Moisturizer by Dermatopics. And I really do like this stuff. It doesn't leave me feeling oily. It leaves my skin feeling very hydrated and overall goes on very smooth and you don't need a lot because a little bit goes a long way. So the next thing I use is a primer from Per Minerals and I really do like this stuff. It goes on very smooth, leaves my skin feeling very soft and I got this in the 4-in-1 Pressed Mineral Makeup Kit. I'm going to go ahead and apply the primer to my face and it's kind of thin. Just need a little bit. So the foundation that I use is the IT Cosmetic in the color light and what I love about this product is that it does have sunscreen in it and it is full coverage. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and apply my foundation. I'm just going to put some on my hand. It has this little pump which is nice. Go ahead and apply it. Alright, so once I have my foundation rubbed in, I use my Bare Minerals Concealer. I'm going to go ahead and put this under my eyes. And I just do a very light line. I don't use a lot. I don't wear a lot of makeup. Alright, so the next product I use is the Mineral Glow by Per Minerals. And I really do like this product. I've used it for a very long time. I just like to apply it to my forehead. This. I'll blend it in. It looks crazy right now. So the next thing I will use is the Per Minerals Afterglow and I just apply this all over my face. The next product I will be using is the e.l.f. palette and I just thought these colors looked really pretty when I first bought it so I will show you guys what they look like. I just think they're so pretty and I really just think they look so beautiful on. I like to apply this color as my base. I just think it looks really pretty and you don't need a lot for me I don't wear a ton of makeup so what I like about this product is that it's easily buildable All right, so the next color I'm going to apply is this brown color right here and I just take a little bit of this I apply it in the creases and I'm no makeup expert I'm just doing what I've done for a really long time I just think again it's so pretty this eyeshadow by bare minerals right underneath my eyebrow so I'm gonna go ahead and curl my lashes You can already tell a difference between the curled and, and the not. I'm going to go ahead and do the next eye. After I have curled my lashes, I apply the L'Oreal Lash Paradise Mascara. And I really do love this product. It's easily buildable and I've never had an issue with it. 
clumping my eyelashes. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply this. And I have used this mascara for a very long time. I just think it goes on a lot better if I just blink a million times. So that's what it looks like. It just makes my lashes look really pretty. So that's what it looks like with one eye done. And I don't really do the bottom lashes. I just do my top lashes. But that's what that looks like. I'm going to go ahead and do this eye. So after I do my mascara, I move on to the lips. And I love lipsticks, lip glosses, lip stains. I love it all. So I have a few favorites I want to share with you guys. Here is the Super Stay Matte Ink in the number 65. I really do like this product. It goes on smooth and it lasts for a very long time. So the next lipstick I love using is by Anastasia Beverly Hills and it is in the color Buff and it is her matte lipstick. And this is such a beautiful color. It goes on so smooth. And it doesn't come off when I'm drinking out of a cup or a straw. It's just really, really pretty. And if you're looking for a good lipstick, I highly recommend checking this one out. And I will link this down below. So one of the products I love using on my lips is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Lip Gloss in the color Vintage. And it is such a pretty color. It has little sparkles in it. It goes on so smooth. And you really only need like one coat and your lips look incredible. It just glides on so beautifully. And I love this lip gloss. I'm gonna use is my Tula Eye Brightening Balm in the Rose Glow and I just think this product is just so pretty when applied over makeup. You can also apply it under if you would like. so much for watching I had so much fun making this video if you guys could comment down below things you would like to see and don't forget to like and subscribe and take care of yourselves and take care of others and I will see you in the next video